Um, let's see, I read the number of pounds of several Henry, Henry's family bought using number names and expanded forms. So there it is. It's a 1.402. So that's standard form. So we need to do that in an expanded form. Um, so it'd be um, 1 uh, plus 4 times, I'm going to put that in parentheses, 4 times, what, 1 tenth, right? Uh, plus, and there's nothing in the hundreds place, so we won't even worry about that. Plus, and then in parentheses, 2 times, what? Uh, 1 over 1,000. And uh, number names. Um, well, if you're listening to this video, I'll just tell you, instead of writing it, it's 1 and 400 two thousandths. 1 and 400 two thousandths. Okay. All right, almost done here. Eight, the store where Henry's family Henry's family shop sold 10 to the third times as many pounds of corn as Henry's family bought. Okay, how many pounds of corn did the store sell? Well, first off, how many did they buy? Henry's family bought 2.556. Okay, so I'm going to write this down here. 2.556. And uh, that's how much Henry's family bought. Okay. And the store sold 10 to the third times that. Well, what's another way of saying 10 to the third? That's going to be 1,000. Three zeros. Right? So where do we move the decimal? Because it says, um, how many pounds of corn did the store sell? Move the decimal three places. This number needs to get larger. One, two, three places. So it's um, two, five, five, six. And I could just put a point zero pounds. And write your answer in standard form and with number names. So that'd be standard form. And oh, that's not a very good looking P there. There we go. And standard, that's standard form. So with number names, it'd be uh, 2,556. 2,556. And again, I'm not going to write that down. I'll let you guys do that. And explain how you found your answer. And don't say Mr. Glazer showed me. So I'm going to let you explain how you found your answer. And that's it. Done with your homework. All right, gosh, I was almost done with that video. It's too bad I have to upload too. It takes time. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow.